create custom course layouts, we choose courses from the opening screen and then custom course layouts. And this lets us create custom pin and T positions for a course and then save that to be used in casual rounds or tournaments. So first of all, let's load a course. In the top left, we can pick a course and we'll choose Illinois Farms. Okay, so here we are on hole one. The course layout that we have loaded right now is the default. This course also comes with a 2013 layout. We can click that and choose load selected layout. And there it is, the T's and pins are moved. If we want to modify this layout then, we just right click where we'd like to place something. So for example, if we want to place a T box right here, we can right click, place T, and we'll put the red T there. We can see the yardage change. We can also zoom in with the mouse wheel and we can scroll with the mouse. And let's put pin position number four right here. Okay, another thing we can do is change the power of the hole. So for example, let's say we want this to play as a par three. Um, we can put a tee box here. We don't have to put the tee boxes on actual tee boxes. We can put them anywhere and um, it'll be the lie that we'll get is a tee lie. We can put it in the rough and, it, and we'll, get a, we'll get a ball on the tee to start the hole. All right, so let's put our tees up here and call it a par three. We can do that. Another thing that's pretty common is taking a par five. If I can find a par five. All right. And let's convert it to a par four for today's tournament. So let's put our tee box up here and maybe some more back here. and call it a long par four. Okay, and then to save our layout, we can either save it as the selected layout, so save it as the 2013 or whatever we choose from the drop-down box. Can't save over the default layout, but we can save over any others. Or we can save as a new layout, type in our name, we'll call it custom, and choose okay, and that'll save our layout. Then when we go to play a casual round or a tournament, we can choose our custom layout from the layout drop-down box, and we'll be able to play with our T and pin positions.